Hey guys, this is Yusuf with that tech though, and this is a speed test comparison between the Google Pixel 3 and the Google Pixel 2. These are the smaller variants, and they are exactly the same in specs, except for that this is a longer display, so it has more resolution going down. It's still a 1080p panel, and this also has the Snapdragon 845 plus the dual cameras, but we really want to see what they are like in performance. So I've got all these apps here ready to go. I'm going to double check that the cache, oh sorry, the recent items are all cleared. Caches are all cleared as well. So we can begin the test. We'll go with the first one and that is The Verge. I've already added that to the home screen via Chrome. So three, two, one and go. So we definitely see the Google Pixel 3 first. We'll go home here. We'll go to Twitter. Three, two, one. Pretty much the same here, didn't notice that much difference. YouTube. Now this shouldn't count because they may have different content, so I'll go to my channel. We'll see which one plays first. Three, two, one. Now this one lagged a bit, but they pretty much are playing at the same time. Camera. Ooh, I'm not sure if this one edged it. Instagram. Pretty much exactly the same here. Pokemon Go. Now this is a very intense app. We'll see which one pulls through. Naturally, it should be the Pixel 3 and it is going through quite fast. Pixel 3 first, followed by the Pixel 2 just now. So we'll be running that in the background as well. Just making sure that these are all there. Temple Run 2. Go. Pixel 3, followed by the Pixel 2. Not that far behind. But the Pixel 3 does have the clear win. We'll let them run. Literally, no pun intended. Mario run. Okay, there's a lot of runs here. Okay, three, two, one. So Pixel 3 again, and it was just a hair second slower on the Pixel 2. And they pretty much loaded at the same time. Okay, let's see. We're seeing very tiny differences. The Pixel 2 is doing pretty decent, but then now the Pixel 3, sorry, the Pixel 2 here did take a bit longer to load. So we'll quickly go to this, go to the first one, start at the same time. Let's see which one loads up first. Pixel 2 did. We'll leave that running at home. Now we'll go to Angry Birds. Three, two, one. Pixel three, pixel two. There's always a delay with Angry Birds, I know it's the app launch time does take a sweet time. But the Pixel 3 did take this one. Running at the background for this. We'll move on to Subway Surfers. Three, two, one. Pretty much open at the same time. And the Pixel 3 just goes through. We'll start to play. Leave them running at the background. Microsoft Word 3, 2, 1. Open exactly at the same time. We'll add a document. We'll add something as write a journal. And we'll leave them running in the background. We'll see which one holds in memory. Go on home. Adobe Draw. Exactly the same. Okay, they pretty much perform exactly the same. We'll leave that running in the background. And that's pretty much it. As for the first lap, let's see how the RAM management is. Now, obviously, the first two apps that I've opened is Illustrator and Word. 
We'll go back to them at the very end, but we'll start off with the word. So here we go. Word, three, two, one. They've opened both at the same time, so both in memory, that's good. Subway surfers. Both in the same place. Great stuff. Angry Birds, three, two, one. Now remember, this isn't about the uh, the actual speed this time. It's more about the memory management. And the Pixel 3 did open up faster, but I'm not too fast because the memory was still in place for both of them. Mario Run. So we have a reload on the Pixel 2. That's quite interesting because they have the same amount of RAM. Yep. Temple Run 2. Both of them kicked out of RAM. Disappointing to see them like that. Pokemon Go. Again, both of them are out. Now, obviously, we see the Pixel 3 obviously opening it faster, but that doesn't mean anything. Instagram. Both in memory, camera, pretty much not able to tell the difference. More or less the same. YouTube, they should be both optimized for this very well, so I'm not too worried about this. Wow. They're both in memory. They did have to load, but they're both still in memory. Twitter. And they're pretty much the same place where I left it. Though I didn't actually scroll through a tweet. Chrome. Now, this is the obvious one if they reload the page or not. They both had to reload. So there you have it. The Pixel 3, not by much, just beat the Pixel 2. It is a bit faster. It does hold a bit more memory than the Pixel 2. Um, but yeah, there you have it. That is the test between the Pixel 3 versus the Pixel 2. Now, I completely forgot to check on the Adobe Illustrator if it's still in memory. So we'll quickly check that. And I'm going to check out Geekbench. That was going to be the last part of the test. And they performed just fine on both of them. We'll open up Geekbench. And go. slower on the Pixel 2 but we'll be leaving them running in the foreground naturally the Pixel 3 will be faster Right, so we have the Google Pixel 3 just about finished and we have the Pixel 2 10% left. I'll speed that through quickly. Right, here you have it. This is the score. So we've got the single score for the Pixel 3, 2347 and the multi-core score of 7139 versus the Pixel 2, 1800 single core score and a multi-core score of 6069 so there you have it this is the test between these two phones and you get to decide which one do you feel like is going to be a better choice for you i can't just do that for you that's totally up to you guys anyways guys i hope you enjoyed this video subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one